how to factor 5z squared plus 7z minus 6. Here's the answer, z plus 2, 5z minus 3. Okay, uh, on the test, for, for you to do this one on, you, so on your own, here's what you do. Um, this is a quicker, dirty visual way. What you do is you draw two boxes. Okay, so you have a z here and 5z here. Obviously, when you go up and down, multiply it, you'll see, you'll see that equal to 5z squared. Okay, now the trick comes onto this chunk over here. You're going to do the same thing here, and you're looking for minus 6. Okay, there's a variety of different ways you can put it in there. You can put a 1 and minus 6, minus 6 up here, and 1, and so on and so forth. So there's quite a bit of uh, variations here. But whatever you do here, let's say you put something in there, and then you're going to do a cross multiply, because this chunk times this box, whatever you put in there, and this chunk times this chunk. And then, then you're going to add it together. Okay, so uh, for this one, I, I've seen the answer before. So this one, I need a 2 in there because 2 and 5 give me 10. 2 times 5 is 10. And since I'm looking for a 7, I'm going to put a 3 here. And it's going to be a minus 3. Okay, so what I have is z minus 2 times uh, 5z, z plus 2 times 5z minus 3. Okay, so let's multiply it out and see if actually we got what we need back over here. So it's 5z squared minus 3z and plus what's on the top, okay, on the top over here. So I have 5z minus 3 and then plus 10z minus 6. And this is precisely our positive 7, the z. So 5z here, okay, minus 6. So our answer is correct, all right? Hope this helps and have a confident day.